Lord help me, I guess I must be a glutton for punishment. That's what she said. But anyway, intro. Yo, what is good, fam bam? It is your boy Jason JV saying welcome to another reaction video. And yes, yes, y'all. Dada released a third, or according to this comment from Knox Hill, a fourth diss track. Damn it, Bobby, this just ain't right. Although, truth be told, I went back to look at the video lineup, and I'm pretty sure this is his third response. But anyway, third or fourth doesn't matter. We're gonna give this a chance. Hopefully, uh, my man has finally learned, you know, to change up his style, step his game up. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! I know, I know. I've seen too much movies that make me want to have more faith in humanity than I should have. But anyway, without further ado, y'all, let's go ahead and get into this. This is Dada's latest response to Knox Hill, simply called E. Okay, so without further ado... Here, here, go. Already getting M Melly Mel, uh, Eminem response vibes with these gunshots. Sense. Uh, Sense. These rap niggas just to play the food. I gotta line them up and I'ma knock them down. Knox better show me how silent sound because he would not survive on my side of town. Niggas better run when that shot buzz. Okay. Okay. I kind of like the flow better in this one. Let me wind this back. To show me how silent sound because he would not survive on my side of town. Niggas better run when that shot bus knocks up. I bet he called the cops up. You're not repeated. Um, cop caller accusations towards Knox Hill. I've heard that before, but um, I, I guess my better judgment, I'm gonna kind of let that slide because I'm liking this flow. Us and nigga, you are not tough, and I'm gonna bring it to you like a potluck. I got the shit popping, niggas know by now. That slow shit, the niggas know my sound. About to bring a body to the O right now. Flow hit you, hit the flow like O like that. I'm more than homicidal, kill shot, but the flow is on the rifle. Knox Hill is a hold that's on the cycle. Get a ride with the dopest motorcycle. You think I like that scheme, and I like how he's maintaining that, that, that fast paced flow. It goes well with this beat that he's rapping on. One of his better uh, produced diss tracks, I will have to admit. I like the mix on this one. It's much more clean. Okay. Think that that nigga flow illy to me and that silly to me, nigga Hillary D. Spitting the words that don't even really just fit on the beat. Shit, how you telling me what I rap like? Niggas trying to sound like they lyrical. Trying to take some in for me to copyright because you're claiming even original. Took my lyrics and ad libs and then you try to even take a little bitch. Nigga, watch me shake all these fleas off me. See, I like how he um, told Knox, like, you know, he, he took his lyrics or whatever, took his ad libs and stuff like that. Um, <clears throat> because as you guys know, Knox did a remix of Stan. That was a diss towards Dada, where he was rapping as Dada. So I like. But although I don't know if that if I would have used that that flip though, because I mean basically you're you're telling everybody that you are basically a Stan. I mean you're kind of um, admitting that when running the risk of trying to flip that diss on <clears throat> on Knox. I'm just saying. Boy, this ain't Oh, and before I progress any further, before I forget, I want to say shout out to uh, Michelle Show. Michelle Show uh, stopped um, at my video where I did a reaction of him reacting to Knox's reaction to Ren's response to uh, Dada. And uh, Michelle Show basically gave me an update in the comment. It's the pink comment in, in that video. So if you want to go back and check out that video and see what Michelle Show said. Basically, he just gave me an update saying that Knox Hill reached out to him. And that they have since settled things and they're at a much better place with each other. So shout out to Knox Hill, you know what I'm saying, for, for being a man. Much love, mad props, you know what I'm saying. All right, let's go ahead and, and uh, get back into this. Nothing but a little itch. Trying to win with some reaction videos. Influencers, I get a nigga. That's a smart move because you know damn well. Lyrically, you can't win a nigga. You better calm down for a bomb out with a song now. Knock it all down, see him crawl out. <clears throat> so... Is he still talking to Knox in regards to, like, reaction videos because, oh, he's not that lyrical? Or is he trying to talk to somebody else? I'm starting to, I'm starting to feel like that's a little sus. I'm just saying. 
the way that Ren brought him up that's the only reason that he ain't died yet so he's acknowledging that okay that Ren showed him love which is cool you know what I'm saying and again shout out to Ren for that mad mad, uh, mad love mad respect you know what I'm saying mad props to Ren for that you know what I'm saying um, so yeah I like that he acknowledged that Ren brought him up and that's the only reason he ain't died yet so which is also uh, a reference to Ren's uh, this, and then of course you know when Ren started things out with that whole funeral uh, session, you know what I'm saying with the bagpipes playing and everything. So yeah, okay, that's cool. Yeah, I'm just fucking around with y'all. It's just fun. I mean, Xerox Hill. Copy yeah. ass nigga. Hey, hey, all that shit you was say, hey, straight up. Oh, Let me say this brother. to you, and I hope this shit is all the way in your ear when you hear this shit, nigga. Listen up. Suck my dick. Okay, okay. All right. <clears throat> Let's get the the um all the good things that I like about this out of the way. I like the beat. I like, I like the flow and the cadence on this beat. I couldn't find a racist bar in there somewhere, which is good. Um, What else? What else? Mm, I think that's pretty much it. So now, Dada, I, I, I just have one question, my guy. Just, just one. Just one. Why didn't you put this out first? You blew it. Oh, my God, dude. You put this out. Two days ago, right? Let me see something here. You put out this untouchable flow, which was three days ago. The Xerox Knox made me cook three days ago. And then you put out this one a day that you, a day later. So eight days after the fact. What? Dog. Dog. This was good. However, it's still not good enough for you to win this this diss track season. <clears throat> Cause Knox hit you with two disses. Both of them were solid. You got this one solid diss out of all three disses that you put out towards dude. Are you serious? Bruh. Had you put out something more like this from the get, you would have had a better chance. But sorry, it's not enough for you to take the W. It was a nice shot, nice attempt. Out of all three disses, this to me right here is your best diss. It shows that you can come with it. You know what I'm saying? When when it's when it comes down to it, if you really have to, you can do it. I'll give you that much. I'll give you that much credit. You know what I'm saying? This was definitely your, your better song. And thank you, thank you, thank you for not going the racist route. You know what I'm saying? Reminding everyone that, oh, that Knox is this white rapper. You know what I mean? This Eminem clone and all this and that. Much better this time around. Not enough to get the W. Sorry, Knox still takes it, man. And that's pretty much it, guys. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Do you agree? Do you disagree? Uh, feel free to sound off in the comment section down below. Um, and yeah, and I say it's a done deal. I, you know, I mean, I don't think Knox really needs to respond. I mean, well, Knox already gave his response in the comment section down below. Stan, listen, son, I'm not mad. It's cute. You were upset. Your first three disses didn't hit so you had to drop a fourth <laughs> i think oh uh, maybe because he's counting the the ren disc where he was mentioned as like a third disc so maybe that's why he, he's saying this is the fourth one i don't know but anyway <clears throat> but i think it's getting a little unhealthy at this point i'm worried about you oh man and of course daughter responds let's see 69 replies we're not gonna read all 69 replies i just want to see 
I mean, is all you know is uh, Eminem references. Damn, can we get a Knox reference? Be yourself, man. This ain't looking healthy. I mean, I gotta give that a credit where credit is due. That is a solid response. <clears throat> I don't know why he um he couldn't incorporate something like that into his his disses as well. Like, dude, is, is, is that all you know? It's Eminem responses. You know what I mean? That's an unhealthy obsession you have because yeah, I mean. I mean that 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 is you know a a worthy uh, a, a worthy return fire you know what I mean Knox apparently is obsessed with Eminem using all these Eminem references and whatnot. As I was saying, I was closing out. Y'all feeling the vibes here? Y'all know what to do. Y'all know how to support your boy. Do all the YouTube thing things to support the channel. You know what I'm saying? And until the next one, y'all bless one. All right, peace. Jason JV on YouTube. Uh, what's up with you, Jason JV? What up, Jason JV? Just sending love, peace, and blessings to you. JC, you are my homeboy, my guy. Don't call me guy, pal. Don't call me buddy, pal. Much love to you, JV. Chris Calico. Cali, baby. Oh. What's up, JV? My name is Jimmy Patrick. I'm after the next video. What's up, JV? What's up, JV? Get your motherfucking head up. Uh, uh, I don't know why you're sad. If you're sad, you're sad. You're sad. You're happy. I'm going to be too happy. I'm going to be expecting shit. It's like doing curves all the time. So you ready to be on swerve. So subscribe. Tap the little bell. Turn on the notifications. And if you're not down with that, we got three words for you. Eat it. Yeah.